So now we have seen what is a pointer. I would like to show you another example before telling you the purpose of a pointer. I'll just create a new file. I'll name it pointer ex2.c. I'm going to declare a simple variable of type float or I'll take it long this time. Anything is fine. Long a equal to I'll say 10. Now long also falls under the family of integers. So it is slightly having more space than integer. Now you can think of it as double the space than integer. This is fine. Now when I say long asterisk or long star p, now p is capable of holding the address of a variable of type long, right? Now I'm initializing it directly with the address of a. So now p is pointing to a. And I'll say long double asterisk q. During the normal declarations, we will attach this star to the variable identifier, that is p. Identifier is nothing but the name of the variable. Now long double star q equal to. So what is double star? It is nothing but a pointer to a pointer. So a pointer to long star. That means a pointer to a pointer of type long. Now double star q equal to ampersand p. Now first time here we call it a is a is a long variable, right? Now here p is a pointer to a long variable. Now what is q? q is also a pointer to a pointer of type long star. Now that means pointer to a long variable. Don't worry, you will understand this. It is easy. Now, I will print percentage LD because it is a long integer. So, A is, I will just print A. Now see the difference. I will say star p is. So I am going to show you the value of star p. And I will say double star q is. I am going to show you the value of double star q. Now see what happens here. GCC pointer ex2.c. Now you can see all three are same. Now this is the trick and this is what you need to understand. So here when I declare the variable as long, I am getting a memory block which is capable of holding a long value. Right. I am initializing that with 10. So the value of a is 10. Now I am declaring p which is a pointer to a long. So it is also a memory variable. It is capable of holding the address of a variable of type long. So p equal to ampersand a. What is ampersand a? So that is address of a. I will say 0x 1a. Now address of a is held in p. So 0x 1a. Then long double star q. Now q is again another variable, but the address of the value inside q will be a pointer to L pointer to long. So that is equal to ampersand p. Now p will also be having some address, right? So let us say 0x 2a. 
and this address is kept inside q so 0x 2a now what q is pointing to q is pointing to p what p is pointing to p is pointing to a so now applying one star over q will take you to this level and applying one star over this address take you to this level that is a now see when you say p you are referring to this block and you can also refer to this block as star q star q or star q or p both refer to this memory variable now when it comes to a this can be referred as star p or a a means this variable and star p is also this variable because p contains the address of this variable and one star will take you one level up that means this one and this can also be referred as double star q actually to help you easily understand this normally this star is used for multiplication and the same star is also used for declaring the pointer variable so don't worry and don't get confused if you carefully observe this particular line how many stars do you need to cross to go to the long one star right when you apply one star to p you go to the long variable long that's it now when you carefully observe this line how many stars you need to cross to go to the long you need two stars so when you apply two stars to q you go to the actual variable long so this is just like this now given that this is the structure and these are the values now q means this variable star q means p both p or star q refer to this memory block and a or star p or double star q refer to this memory block and this is the star notation you just need to understand that from q to long you need to cross two stars that's the point and from p to long you need to cross one star so when i say one star one level of in direction and this is how it is and until or unless you understand the purpose of it you may not be clear about these topics but don't worry you will get into that